My name is Dustin Williams and welcome to my channel. I moved out to Southern California to pursue my passion as a filmmaker and car enthusiast. On my channel, you'll get to follow along on my dream car life racing cars, building cars, and traveling to Japan to drive and build my R34 GTR. I love Japanese culture and cars, so that's mainly what you'll find here. I also built a street apparel brand called Legends based on my experiences, cars, and Japanese culture. It's been a crazy ride so far, and I can't wait to see where life takes me. So let's strap in and enjoy today's video. Look at Paul over there doing his filming. Please excuse the, uh, the swollen face still. It was day four, and my mouth still can barely open. No excuses here. Paul is doing some work out here. So I'm gonna give you guys a quick shop update. This is actually a really big update right before concrete gets poured. I can't talk too much, so I'm gonna have Tiana and Paul, who's actually our contractor, do a lot of the talking. But uh, check this out, guys. Last thing you guys saw was them actually digging out where the footings are gonna go for all the steel and stuff. And now, they're actually getting it ready. It is so crazy. Paul, this is insane. Rundown is, we're setting all the forms. Uh, that the, was the next step after getting the footings dug. So we're setting all the forms. You can see we put strings and everything. Uh, that way we can line the forms nice and straight. And then the guys right now, they're hammering kickers. So those kickers go uh, on the inside and outside. And we put a nail through those kickers. And that holds the form where it's at when we're pouring this heavy concrete. And then the next step will be to grade the inside here nice and flat and compact it with a compacting machine. And then we start putting all of our steel down holy crap i mean it's like it's like taking shape now oh, i yeah. can't even this is blowing my mind right now i wish i could smile but <laughs> <laughs> this looks so cool look at this so do you guys fill all this with steel or every bit of it well, there's sure. a lot of steel that goes in here uh the engineering on these things is no joke there's a lot of steel that goes in here there's cages steel cages that go down inside these footings and then the rebar that we lay out here in the middle is on two foot center both ways so this whole entire thing will be covered in steel so this shop is not moving <laughs> no the shop's it's not, not moving, moving. <laughs> no it's not going anywhere and you can really see like how big it's going to be now too now that it's like all cut and carved out and like this is going to be a freaking sick shop this is going to be so cool no, it's, yeah it's nice <laughs> i can't wait to work on my trucks here <laughs> <laughs> don't make me smile damn it <laughs> They're first gonna lay the slab for the actual building right here, but then what we're standing on currently is gonna be our entire driveway, right, Paul? Yeah, so we have, we cut the curb back when we were doing the grading. We cut the curb, you can see the saw cuts in it. We'll take that curb out, and then we'll make a nice entrance that goes down right here so the water can still come around the lot and then exit out over here at the street. So, so then all, all this is gonna yes. be concrete. All of it will be concrete all the way up. We'll gra gradually bring it up to the opening of the garage doors and we'll make it because you guys build those lowered cars and stuff, we'll make it so nothing bottoms out. But uh, yeah, all this will be concrete all the way over to the swale right here and then everything will naturally drain out and down the road. Sounds good to me. Go to a nice car show. 
for me. So we're heading there right now. We're about, let's see. We are about 15 minutes away. So almost there. Let's go have some fun. We have definitely made it. There are some sick cars here. So I gotta figure out where in the hell to go and set up. So I'll update you guys as soon as I find out. We made it and it is freaking sick. Let's go check it out. This is inside the venue. Unfortunately, the GTR wouldn't fit up this thing. There's no way that the Varus front lip is gonna make it up this. So we left it outside, but it's really cool because we have Paul Walker's Motor X R34 and the 400R next to the R35, which is super sick. But if you come inside the actual venue here, it is, oh, there's Brian. This is so sick. This is gonna be an awesome meet. We have Larry's R32 over there, which we're gonna go check out. You guys haven't seen that in a really long time. It has the fully built RB28. What up? My GTR wouldn't make it up to the thing. I know. <laughs> Dude, this is freaking sick. It's big venue, right? This is awesome, man. One car in here that really stood out to me, well, two cars actually, but Vincent, nice to meet you, Vincent. Vincent, this is your Hachiroku right here. Yeah, yeah. This thing is so cool. So it's kind of like a, like an initial D. That's so sick. And something cool that Vincent told me is that you're actually opening up a little cafe yeah. where you're going to be delivering or selling tofu. Selling tofu, yeah. yeah. that's so cool. So of course, you had to get the initial D themed 86. Man, this thing is so awesome. Oh. One day, guys, just wait. Just wait. Oh my God. A Hakoska, guys. Damn, Larry out here stunning. Let's see, can we see under the hood? We haven't, it's been too long. This is one of the most beautiful engine bays on an R32 that I've ever seen. Garage source belt, let's see it. These are the, my favorite engine covers on an RB. Oh my God, Larry, she's beautiful. We're gonna have to get both the GTRs together once mine's yeah, done. And soon. But yeah, okay. I, when yours actually gets tuned. But yeah, if you guys don't know, we talked a little bit about this a couple of videos back, but this is a full RB28 garage Taurus build. You said, how much power is this gonna, is this gonna be pushing when it's all said and done? Eight or nine? On 91. Oh my God, on 91? Yeah, that's the goal, pump gas. It's good. It's just really good, guys, as you can see. And the titanium garage store strut tower bar. This thing is sick, Larry. The car show is now finally about to start. We have a pretty sick spot here, so we have the R35, we got the 400R, and like I told you guys a little bit about, this is Paul Walker's Motor X R34 too from Hive. They're just buying up everything. You guys saw this a little bit in our Cars and Coffee video. The whole setup's really cool. We should do a quick walkthrough of some of the cars out here because this event has brought out some really, really sick builds and I'm super stoked, so let's check it out. Guys, this is, a, this is a monumental moment right now. In another dimension, another life, <laughs> me me and Michael here are best friends. You guys may know him as Sony. Yeah. The World at War, our World of World of Warcraft streamer. Thank you, yeah. yeah. Wait, I've been streaming for eight years, but yeah, I'm, I'm into cars as well, so that's how yes. we met. Kind of. Yes, so we're finally getting to meet in person. In another dimension of our life, we were best friends. Literally lifting, games, anime. cars, anime, anime. everything. Yeah. It's dope, but he brought, us, brought me a present to commemorate our first three. time. Let's see it, flip him over. 
the starters. Oh my god, that's sick, dude! <laughs> I'm going in the collection, this is gonna be dope. Absolutely. <laughs> Quick car show break to Little Tokyo, We're getting some ramen. Super, super bomb. I am geeking out right now. We're in Little Tokyo, but there's this one so 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 something wrong with us. He people. doesn't Who believe has me. a Godzilla collection like this? <laughs> this store has like every Godzilla imaginable, and it's amazing. We're trying to find one that I don't have so I can pick one up today for the collection. We took an L on it. I already had everything. So, maybe next time. Well, guys, that's a wrap for today. I try to film as much as possible. My mouth is actually killing me. We went to Little Tokyo so that I could try and get some ramen, at least some broth, so I can eat. And I could barely even eat the, uh, oh my god. This road is terrible. I could barely even eat the noodles or anything in the ramen, so I'm struggling. I can't really talk too much, but we we're heading home. It was an awesome, awesome meet. So many amazing cars, and it was a ton of fun getting to see everybody. Um, so yeah, we're gonna head home, and I actually have something to show you guys. We have a huge Legends Black Friday sale going on starting Wednesday, where you guys are gonna be able to get up to 80% off of anything on the Legends site. So we're gonna head home, I'm gonna show you everything that we're dropping on Wednesday for VIP members, and, and everything that you guys can get 30 to 80% off of. It's freaking sick. So uh, let's head home, and I'll show you guys all of that stuff. All right, we have finally made it home. It has been such, it's been such a long day, but I wanted to show you guys really quickly. We have a Black Friday sale starting this Wednesday for VIP members only. They get early access starting Wednesday, but the Black Friday sale will actually open up to everybody on Black Friday. And the cool thing about this is we, we actually have a whole new line of stuff that we're going to be dropping as well as everything on the site is going to be 30 to 80% off. But everything that you're about to see right now is going to be 30% off. And what we kind of do on Black Friday with Legends is we take our best sellers of the entire year and kind of revamp them a little bit, add a new design, add a new color to them, and drop them for 30% off for all of you guys. So like I said, starting on Wednesday, VIP members will be able to access that. And then on Friday, everyone will be able to access it. But I wanted to go ahead and go through everything that we're gonna be dropping this Wednesday and Friday for you guys. So sorry for the mess here. This has literally been my cave for the past week since I've been out with my wisdom teeth surgery. I've lived at the computer playing Halo and stuff. So bear with me here, but I'm gonna do a quick walkthrough of everything that you guys can expect because this stuff is super dope. So number one, we are bringing back the legends outdoor stuff which is really really sick and we have this heavyweight jacket we did a jacket similar to this when, when we did the actual drop but we wanted to revamp it a little bit make it a little bit heavier super dope it's actually quilted on the inside this is gonna be perfect now that it's getting cold and especially because we're gonna be taking some more camping trips too so we're definitely gonna be rocking this we'll be the brand new legends outdoor uh, heavyweight jacket if you guys remember a couple years ago when we did the Carhartt jackets this is exactly what that reminds me of and then we're also bringing back the t-shirts we did something a little bit different with these and we made the colors a little bit darker i really like the colors that we dropped when we did the legends outdoor drop so we kept the same thing just changing it up just slightly so we have the maroon and the forest green like i said just a little bit darker and lastly for the legends outdoor drop we also did a black hoodie so i think when we did the hoodies for the legends outdoor drop we only did uh, like a bone color. This time we did black. I know how much you guys like all of our black hoodies So we decided to do the legends outdoor on a black and it came out pretty awesome. I am stoked Next up one of my personal favorite drops of the year was actually the midnight legends Neon koi drop and I know a lot of you guys like that too So we're gonna bring that one back and we actually added a new colorway Which I think is almost even sicker than the first time So this is the neon koi that we're gonna be dropping on Wednesday and Friday again for you guys. And this is actually neon pink and blue, which it looks freaking dope, guys. It is so cool, freaking sick. And we have tons of accessories too, guys. Um, you guys may have seen a little bit of it at the beginning of the video, like the jet tags and the stickers that we have of all this. It is dope. Let me go ahead and get you guys the front hit here. So that's the neon Midnight Legends Koi Drop. We have a hoodie, we're gonna have a hat, and we also have t-shirt to be the artwork on the back, and then 
the logo on the front. Really dope. Another banger of this year was the Geisha drop. And we're actually gonna be bringing that back too. This time we did a black long sleeve here. As you guys can see, when we did the Geisha drop previously, we only did a black short sleeve. So now we have the long sleeve and it even has a really sick sleeve hit too. And it's like kind of like a little Easter egg. If you guys check out the Geisha's arm, she has the tattoo right here as well. And it's on our sleeve. So I thought that was a cool little touch. And then also, I love red t-shirts, and I love when we do our designs on red t-shirts. So, we're bringing the Geisha Drop to a red t-shirt. So, there's the front hit right here. And we flip it over on the back, we have the Geisha design on the back. And I think it looks really sick, especially with, like, the, the Oni fan, too. It's just so cool. This is some of the coolest artwork. So, we have all of that dropping this Wednesday for VIP members. You guys are going to get early access starting at 10 a.m. Pacific time, which is when my video drops. And then Friday, 10 a.m. Pacific time for all of you that are not VIPs. And now's the best time to sign up for VIP, guys. You get so many benefits, like early access on drops. You get an exclusive t-shirt every single month that nobody else gets except VIPs. You get little extras inside your packages. We do monthly FaceTime with members and we do exclusive VIP events. And it's only gonna keep getting better, especially for 2022, which I'm really, really excited for. But yeah, I just wanted to give you guys a quick rundown of all of our Black Friday deals going on. Um, like I said, everything on the site is 30 to 80% off. So all of the awesome stuff that we have besides this on the site is gonna be marked down as well. So get ready, it's gonna be awesome and I'm freaking stoked about it. All right, so to end our night here, we are eating sushi. It's my first time eating like real substancey food besides soup and mashed potatoes, which I think I've had mashed potatoes and soup for every since meal. every single meal since Tuesday. And I'm literally so miserable. One of the hardest parts of my wisdom teeth surgery was not being able to eat. It's been miserable. So I'm actually gonna try and eat a little bit of sushi. I can feel that my wounds are closing up. It's just really sore for me to like open and close. Hey, what are you, no. <laughs> Crazy. Really hard for me to like just open and close my mouth constantly. And so that's the hardest part that I'm having, but we're gonna have some sushi. And we are actually starting Lord of the Rings. So this is actually the second one, the two towers. Tiana's never, never seen, seen Lord seen of the it. Rings. So we're doing a marathon. We watched the first one. We're in the middle of the second one. Then we're gonna watch the third one and then we're gonna start The Hobbit, which I'm super excited for. I love The Hobbit. You haven't seen The Hobbit? You haven't even seen the movie? I know, but they're in Oh, they're in, in the Lord movie. The oh, it's gonna be good. The Hobbit's my favorite, personally. Um, We're gonna watch this, eat some sushi, and end our night. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I know it's probably all over the place and that's really just because I can't. can't. Really because Dustin's all over the place right now. Yeah, I can't talk or process things in my head right now because I haven't I've been cooped up in the house for too long. But the regular videos resume this week, hopefully work on Tim's car in the next video. So stay tuned for that. And I have a lot of awesome projects coming up, including the secret car that we still haven't revealed. We're almost there. We're almost there. And it's going to be awesome. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I will see all of you in the next one. Peace out.